If you have a moment, please go subscribe to my second channel. Link to that channel will be in the description down below. I'll be posting all of my jump shot, dribble tutorial, build videos, and all that on that second channel. Please check it out if you have a moment. Much love. In this video, I'm coming at you guys with an AFK VC glitch that you can use to make a lot of VC. Make sure y'all boys drop a like, drop a sub, turn on post notifications, man, and listen to this video very carefully. There's a few different steps that you need to take to ensure that you get as much VC as fast as possible. I'm gonna go over everything that you guys need to do. And yeah, man, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get right into the video. All right, so listen, man, for this first step, if you're if you're on Xbox, I've already done it for you. All you have to do is download my roster. If you're on PlayStation, however, I'm gonna show you guys how you can do it for yourself. So yeah, man, first thing that you guys would wanna do is go over to features, go over to create roster, hit NBA, and then you'd wanna hit, if you're making a new one, you'd wanna hit official 2K sports roster. Like I said, if you're on Xbox, you don't have to do this because I've already done it for you. Now listen, what you wanna do is basically make a super team. I use the Philadelphia 76ers just because it's a lot easier because they already have two superstars. So for the rest of this team, what you wanna do is select on whatever player that you wanna remove. So keep Embiid and Harden. And then you just want to you just want to release everyone else from this team if that makes sense all these other players you can just release now once you release all the other players you then want to go through all the nba teams and pick the best players that you want on your team for example you could go for uh him right there and then you want to go to assign to another team pick the pick the philadelphia 76ers and then now you have three superstars on one team and then you would want to do that for every single team until you have 15 superstars on your team if that makes sense now next you want to go into the quick edit mode by pressing start and then what you want to do is make all of your players as tall as possible so you can edit the whole entire column and then you can make everyone 7-7 seven, seven. you can give everyone max stats like you're seeing right here you'll have max stats max defense max dunk rating max three-pointer all that you don't want to do that for all of your players and then you can also go over to if you press Y or triangle you can go over to your tendencies you can go over to this as well and then you can also give everyone Hall of Fame badges as well so you want to do that for all of your players and then after you guys have edited everything that you need all you want to do is hit B e on your controller confirm changes and then you want to go to save and share roster listen if you're on playstation this is what you need to do i've already made my roster like i said so i'm not going to save this one if you're on xbox you can use my roster and i'll show you guys how to do it in one moment but i wanted to show all my playstation users how to set up their own demigod roster which is going to allow you to make a lot of vc so yeah man after you guys have made your roster all you want to go all you want to do is go over to my league and then you want to go ahead and start a brand new my league now once you guys get here you want to hit y to select roster or triangle if you're on playstation but like i said i don't really know if there's any good rosters that you can download on playstation but you want to go to user generated roster and then go to search and search by content name so you want to type in jr way too cold two to five my roster i have another roster on here but that's for the blacktop vc glitch you want to use jr way too cold two and then you guys will see that make sure you hit the jr way too cold two one like i said the other one is called blacktop glitch this is for the mildly glitch so select on that one and then you guys can go ahead and go to current nba teams and then you can hit start in regular season go over to your setup options there's a few different things that we need to change right here. Listen, you want to put this quarter length all the way on 12 minutes. You can pick any quarter length that you would that you would like, but you get the most VC possible for doing 12 minutes. So why wouldn't you do that? But yeah, man, put that on 12 minutes, and then after you do that, you can go ahead and start in regular season. You're gonna to go to start mode. Make sure you pick the Philadelphia 76ers as your only team, and then you want to go ahead and advance. 
and then from here you can advance through this as well now listen you guys can hit auto generate rookies from here and then there's a few different things that we need to change once again so you want to go over to um your settings on your my league go over to your options there's a few different things that we want to change first thing is go to your coach settings and make sure you put the timeouts on manual whenever we're doing this glitch and it's simulating for us timeouts slow down this glitch so putting your timeouts on manual will make this glitch go by a whole lot faster so make sure you change that and then also for your cp and user sliders listen i have one port that you can use as well so you could you guys can actually search up they are way too cold if you go to search and uh, search under your game slider picker go to search by content name type in jr way too cold once again if you're on xbox and then you'll be able to find my settings these settings are super far and they're going to allow you to get through this glitch a whole lot faster you guys can see the name right there if you're on playstation just try to pick a random one i don't really know um if there will be any good ones on PlayStation or not, just make sure you pick the one that says JR Way Too Cold. There's a few other ones that say JR Way Too Cold as well, but you guys should see, see mine as well. But you wanna go ahead and set that as your slider. So you guys can see that I made the CPU extremely bad. They have all basically zero stats, meaning they're never gonna score. And then for us as the user, we have basically everything on 100. So these are the fire sliders that you need to get through this glitch and make as much VC as possible. Now listen, once you guys have changed all those settings, you can go back to the calendar and then you wanna go ahead and select on the first game that you see. And then you wanna make sure that you go ahead and simulate this with a Simcast Live. And then you will go ahead and load into to this game. And basically what's gonna happen is once this game starts up, you want to adjust the simulation speed by pressing right on the right stick. The, the fastest that you can go is six, so make sure you have that on there. And then basically from here, you don't have to do anything whatsoever. Your team's gonna win 100% of the time because of the stats. You basically have a demigod team of all seven, seven players. And yeah, man, the other team basically won't be able to score. And the only thing that slows you down is whenever the other team calls a timeout. So if you're looking at this, if you're in your room, whatever the case may be, you can select A or X and that will skip the timeout for the other team. But like I said, this is an AFK glitch. So once this glitch starts, you can literally go into the other room, you can watch a movie, do your homework, you can let this run while you're doing anything. You can let this run while you're doing your homework, while you're watching TV, whatever the case may be, you can literally go AFK during this part but these games with these settings that i've showed you guys go extremely fast so you want to check on this as consistent as you can because once this game is over with then you'll just have to restart and go to the next game but you guys can let this run as long as you want throughout the whole entire day so yeah man i'll catch you guys once this game is over with Okay, so look man once this game is over with you want to go ahead and hit quit and then you guys will see that you'll get your vc on the bottom left hand side now listen once this game is over with all you want to do is go to the next game hit simulate with simcast live and you want to make sure like i said that the quarter length is on 12 minutes you guys can see that if you go over to your your settings and then make sure the quarter length is on 12 minutes and that will allow you to get double DC. So keep that in mind. When I've done this in this video to speed it up, it was on six minutes. Make sure you put it on 12 minutes. Yeah, man. It's been your boy JR. Thank you boys so much for all the support. We out. Peace.